to analyze the challenges of being a lacrosse goalie. We brought in Penn State alum and 2015 MLL Goalie of the Year, Drew Adams. At 36 square feet, lacrosse's goal is 50% larger than hockey's. And lacrosse goalies don't wear extra padding on their arms or legs. This means, all else being equal, a lacrosse goalie creates an obstacle about 17% smaller than a hockey goalie. In addition to the inherent size disadvantage, some lacrosse shots are literally impossible to defend because of the physical limits of the human body. The fastest a human can react to visual stimuli is roughly 200 milliseconds. But from 30 feet away, a lacrosse ball rifled at over 100 miles per hour can reach the net in just 190 milliseconds. That's about the same amount of time a baseball player would have facing a 200 mile per hour fastball. Data from our eye tracking glasses shows about a third of a second before typical shot is released, Adams' eyes fixate on the stick's head. Like a boxer predicting an opponent's punch sequences, this helps Adams anticipate the shot location and begin moving for the save just 120 milliseconds after release. We want to do a little test with you. We want to line up three guys. Each has a ball. Only one's going to shoot, though. Uh, it sounds like a good challenge. Let's do it. <laughs> In this firing squad test, Adams can't fixate on just one stick. That's why, without knowing the shooter, his reactions are almost three times slower. So to make a play on the ball, Adams extends his stick from zero to 20 miles per hour in just 125 milliseconds. That's an acceleration on par with the rattlesnake strike. And incredibly, this allows him to stop nine of 11 shots on goal. So how was that? Oh, it was awesome. It was definitely difficult, challenging, but it definitely put the, the skill set to the test. For more evidence that lacrosse goalie is possibly the most unfair position in sports, consider this. In D1 ice hockey last season, the average save percentage was about 91%. Now, even though there were about 40,000 fewer shots on goal in lacrosse, the average save percentage was just 51%. Basically, a coin toss. For ESPN Sports Science, I'm John Brinkus.